Artist, you have six hours to create a schematic tattoo. And your time starts now. Let's do this. All right, so I'm gonna have you stand right here. Okay. The one thing about these schematic drawings is there's no place to hide. You're looking at just the outline, and it's a technical drawing. If you don't do it perfect, it's gonna fall apart. I think I just noticed it's facing the wrong way. The blade should be on this side. If we flip it, then it's not true to the knife. Yeah, it is. I don't know about that. I know about that. <laughs> no, I know you do, but I'm saying, like, there's also rules to what we do. Yeah, but my left arm is right. this way. <laughs> I could just flip it around. Yep. Your tattoo, it's permanent. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just flip it. Just give me like two minutes. Yep. All right, Amber, you about ready? Do it. All right, here we go. I think the West is trying to shake me up, thinking that it's going to be hard because it's a lot of circles. And this thing has some pretty bold ass lines on it, so. Yeah. That looks really good. The circle, it has to be smooth. It can't have any bumps. And it has to connect exactly where it's supposed to connect. I've been tattooing for a while, but it wasn't until eight years ago that I could just finally, like, everything else. Yeah. Just tattoo. I really haven't been able to shine here and show off myself. I'm a very strong tattooer, and I'm going to show that today. It's funny, it's like, I make my own hours, mm -hmm. but I work more hours than most people still. That's the best way to be. It's like, if you love something, do it. Tattooing eight years, and I've only ever had one other job, and so tattooing is pretty much all I know, which right. is trippy to think about. All I wanted to do with this tattoo is show off my line work, and it is going the polar opposite way. All of those tiny lines. They had a lot of detail there. I can feel how soft this guy's skin is and how easy it will be to blow these lines out. My only option is to try to pull this off. This day sucks. Artists, four hours to go. That's a cool piece. Thank you. When I saw everybody else, I was like, oh, I could have done this a lot easier. Damn it. That's not who I am. <laughs> I've been obsessed with robots since I was a kid. And I do a lot of biomechanical that involves a lot of robotic structures and stuff. This is a total shoe in for me. Almost there with the lines. Like some dots and stuff left. Oh, son of a bitch. Every three dots I do blow out. Every other line I do blows out. I don't understand what's going on. Am I sitting okay for you? Any issues? Oh, yeah, you're sitting great. Yeah. It's just like I'm a perfectionist. This is a disaster. I am scared shitless right now. Your skin doesn't like this stencil at all. Oh, no. <laughs> hates it. It's trying to get rid of it on me. With all the skin, you don't know what you're going to get into. It's usually prone to blowouts. It could just split open on you. It's always thin. So I'm playing it simple. The outline's pretty much done. I mean, yeah, it doesn't need shading. I guess I'm just not used to having this much time left over. Should I order a pizza? Maybe I'll uh, mess around with it on paper and see if there's anything else that makes sense. I don't know if this thing even reads as a schematic tattoo. My best chance is to zoom in on some of the details that I already have there. Either way, I'm taking a risk here. If I do add it in and I don't pull it off, I may not finish my tattoo. Well, I mean, you nailed it. That's cool, though. Yeah. Very cool, dude. Thanks. We got Frank's approval. Two hours to go. You have two hours remaining. I'm surprised you picked that one. But... Kicking myself for picking something with all these gears. In retrospect, I think maybe the pocket watch was a bad idea. The schematics were kind of an afterthought, and it's probably going to come off that way. I know I can do a super clean watch. And then I was like, oh, yeah, it has like a ton of gears inside. Yeah, it's a schematic, man. I got to pick this tattoo, and now I look like a fool dropping the ball on something that I thought was going to be simple. No matter who has skull pick and what they give me, I'm going to do a good tattoo, period. They thought that I was going to change the placement, but I was like, nope. Well, that's good, because I wasn't going to change the placement. <laughs> yeah. I don't mind tattooing the spine. You know, the West, they just panic easy. There's like three people on West that I feel like did all that good. Raul was hiding some mistakes. Bob had the blowouts. Yeah. And Arlene, for having Skull Pig, did not do near as well as they should have today. With the redness and the swelling, fault use witch hazel. It helps. Nice. My canvas has skin tags and moles all throughout his forearm. So my lines aren't as straight as they usually are. I got my first tattoo like the day I turned 18. <laughs> my mom is like, what is that? 
I've come from a very strict religious upbringing and tattoos are definitely not something you want to do. She's all, that better be a fake tattoo. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, I'm gonna, about to go wash it up right now. My late brother, he passed less than a year ago. He was really like the only one who was very supportive. One of the last things that he said to me, he was like, Arlene, you should, you could win. Like you could totally do that. I don't want to let him down. I want to be an inspiration and honor my brother. One, that's it, machine's down, time is up. No more ink. Alrighty, looks like we are all done. Awesome, looks dope. All right, man, we're all set. Thank you. Oh, thank you. We're all done. Bob drew his completely by hand, but there's like a buttload of blowout. Uh, Don't stress something you can't control now. I know, yeah, It's well, done. You're going home, Bob. I know. It's not over till it's over. We don't know that yet. Who knows, Jason could have not done a schematic at all.